Hello, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Charlemagne. Well, Cagliari on the Charlemagne patch. Knew I was going to get that wrong at one point. Anyway, so we have this issue that this. Let's see this tab. This independence faction. Which apparently in the time since I last looked at it has mostly disappeared. But it's, it's been sitting around. I guess it's because we had a hundred opinion battles in there and they've decided to leave. As they shouldn't have joined in the first place. Okay, so. Ah, ugh, totally mixed up. I've decided that we probably want to change the centralization law, if we can. When we get it. To be something, like, completely decentralized. And my reasoning for this is we don't want personal realm size. We have no reason to have personal realm size in the slightest. Because we only have a single county. So this just does make sense. We want to go for minimum centralization. Just seeing whether it has anything wrong with that. No. Yeah, we want to just go minimum centralization, give us an extra 10 vassals. But we can't do that for another year. June the 7th. So we're going to kind of sit around till June the 7th. That's the plan. Let's sort out some other stuff. So, well. You can't execute. You hold a temporary title. No, you don't. Well, I guess we've got permanent prisoner. This is a bit odd. I'm still trying to figure out what she. Okay. Must be because this revolt is kind of bugged a little bit. Maybe it'll end soon. Is that the revolt? Ah, once this army dies, the revolt will end. That's my theory. Anyway, so. We're waiting around until June the 7th. So once we sort out our vassal problem, our next. Thing will be to, well, I think we should continue fixing the vassal problem afterwards. Like, once we've got up our limit a bit closer, we should continue going even further into fixing it. So, what do I mean by this? Well, what I mean is we should look for kingdoms to create, opposed to looking for um, vassals to. And opposed to just looking for the weakest person and grabbing them, we should look for someone who will allow us to create a king and grab them. And that way we can lower our vassals until a point that we're happy with. Um, we'll send our army over here. Yeah. That left in the wrong province? Left the wrong province. Right. I'm also not happy that we got an extra five vassals there. That was a bit of a bad move on my part. I kind of assumed that the revolt would end, but they seem incapable of killing a 64 person stack. It's almost worth declaring a war just to do it for them. Similar, I believe we probably have a truce. I totally missed I was like, we're gonna wait till this date and then missed it. Oh, I wanna go straight to minimal. Oh well we get an extra five vassal limit by doing this. So medium centralization. It passed, when can we pass the next one? Five years. Okay, get an extra five vassals. Hopefully we get some more money. No? We can get more money. That's a shame. Hmm. Okay, well, we should just look for things to grab. There somewhere. What's it? Du jour under? Du jour under the Duchy of Leon? We own the Duchy of Leon. 
Right. That's fine. We'll grab it. We can also grab the, we could grab that one. Um uh, what's the reason why we couldn't create the bit down here? Can't assert because part of war. Okay. It's just like part of lots of revolts. Okay. Well we could help them by taking away the revolts from one by one. Okay. Mission to Rome has been a success. Cat more Catholic faith. That's good. Is there any land over... Was there not... Am I imagining things or was there a kingdom like right here? There was this guy, right? Kabulistan. Are you now under... Right, you're still the Duchy of Kabulistan, but you managed to lose it to the Indians. Interesting. Do you want to be my vassal? What's your leash? I hope that one of my kings over here will grab him. He should lose that duchy very soon. We didn't wipe it out his army? Okay. Well, that should wipe that. We've won that revolt. Good. Won the peasants revolt. Execute the leader. We'll attack Salamanca. We do to your claim of Salamanca, Holy War for Leon. These separate revolts? That would be awesome if those these are separate revolts. Okay. Let's do this as your claim. I mean I would do a holy war, but I just kinda I don't want to deal with having to sort out the vassals afterwards. A little bit of a long off to save. Well, let's assault down the holding. Just treating these retinues straight up as event spawn troops. Here. Right, 100%. We've won the revolt. It's right. He now controls all this land. He likes us more because we pressed his claim. Good. And the, he should be under someone else. Yes. Good. This is a... That, that's not a revolt. That's not a revolt. Okay. And we can't usurp his titles yet. Are we gaining money? No. We just get quite a lot from winning these wars, I think. Hmm. Yeah, and he's still the leader of the revolt. That's weird that the revolt's still going up. You shouldn't be in this faction. He shouldn't be in the faction because he's got a hundred opinion on me. I wonder what affects vassal limits, so it's Empire rank, Ruler Diplomacy, so the base is 1, the Empire rank is times 30, Ruler Diplomacy bonus, so how does that equal, yeah 36, okay. So if we had someone who had more diplomacy, so if we were to kill our wife and get someone with higher diplomacy, I would fix it. That could help fix it. So if a ruler of diplomacy bonus is plus six, I'm trying to work out where that number comes from. Like, is it just the? Uh, no, it's our base plus three eminence on a strap. How would I donate money to these guys? Temple Vassal opinion. Oh. 
I could welcome the Jews back. Which would take away the minus two from Expel the Jews, which should increase our vassal limit. Jews have been banned from the realm for some time. Strangely, they seem to have no effect on many of the malices that they were thought responsible for, such as famine and disease. By now, most of the Jews seem to have forgiven your offences, and you've decided to welcome back open arms. So we get 50 prestige. And my diplomacy has gone up. This didn't affect my vassal limit, though. I wonder what it's based on. Hmm. I think I'm going to try killing my wife. And then I'll get someone of really high diplomacy and we'll see if that will affect it. Okay. Range marriage from... No. Okay, he's declared war for Kabulistan. That's a good job that he's doing that. That's land that we would quite like. Back. And hopefully that'll help this solve a bit of that problem. Yes. Okay. Who is enjoying this with really high plot power? Nobody. Okay, 160 plot power. This should pop any moment soon. He is improving opinion with the Pope. Good. Actually, we should set our Chancellor to improve opinion with the person in the faction. So, who's running the faction? Duke Bruno of Surencia. Any reason you don't like me? High Crown Authority, large feudal tip. I could lower Crown Authority. Yeah. The well, vassal titles can now pass outside the realm for inheritance. I'm not too bothered about that. Pull or crown authority. Fine. You got the vassal inheritance warning, that's a problem, but it's a problem I'm sure the vassals can deal with. Did that end our independence faction? No. They do like us a bit more though. I'm just trying to get everyone to like us a little bit more. I'm not going to designate him where I've That's a bit uh, suicidal. But we'll spend money to get him out of the faction. Faction disappears. Perfect. <sighs> okay, so we got our 8,000 troops down here. Who are you? West African Uprising. Oh, we'll, we'll uh, clear the revolt for... um. Our friends, the Sulemans. We want to get rid of all of its revolts. Ah, we have a poisonous snake. Good. So I'll bring them back. I'm starting to think Agostina might fancy me. I'll make a move. It's good to be the Emperor. Success, the snake performed its duty with a plum and pumped Gormleith full of deadly venom. It slipped away into the nights and the guards were too busy containing with a stri string of lethal snake attacks to search for the people responsible. So that didn't lower my, uh... Yeah, it lowered my bonus by one. So she had 12, which half of that came to me, so that's six. That lowered my bonus by one. I have no idea what the calculation is. Well, we'll arrange marriage between me and... Well, you have the largest diplomacy, so you. Well, that was only within our realm. Hmm. Could have looked further, but that's fine. Narrow bonus is seven. Okay. So I gave us one more vassal limit. 
But one more of my vassals decided to start a war. I think. We have more count level vassal. Yeah, okay, these are the ones from over there. You know what? I'll just put them underneath um, you, which is nice. Ah, tra transferring vassals. I'm happy this one's working this time. Right. We're now 40 out of 37. Surely we must be... Right, we're receiving some levies. We're losing 12.9%. We're now making a monthly balance of some money. Okay. We're very, very close to being able to actually reinforce our retinue. Which is our in them. We also have some armies now. Fantastic. We can do stuff. I like that even with the, the penalties to army levies of 12.9%, we still have 41,000 people. So, what are we in the declare war for? Well, I'd like to declare war for Italy, so we need to do one more holy war to get the land for it. Let's see what we got down here. Okay. Do we have a truce of the Ag Agamemnons? Yes. Okay. We have some weak claims. We can claim for Wiltshire. Holy War for Wessex. Um. Yeah. That looks like an okay war. How many men does he have? 2,000 right now, so he's weak. We'll do the Holy War for Wessex. We can invite someone to it. Might as well. How many men do you have for me? It's barely worth raising them. Let's see, Brittany, how many men do you have? 8,000? That's reasonable. It's not 800, 700. Don't want to raise too many. Just want to raise the right amount. Uh, let's go into Vassal. Navarra. Vassal. Aquity. Yeah, I probably could have just raised Aquity. Raise all the boats. Let's see if I can remember the hotkey to get them onto boats. Just got that one. Try a few more. Ah, perfect. If they can't get onto boats, I'm just not bringing them. I think. Yeah. Got control of all the boats. We will now bring them all to death. She didn't join the war. Not a big surprise. It was a bit far away. Well, EU4 hotkeys there. And I think I will end the episode here. Thank you for watching. Next time we'll have a bit more action. And I'll see you then. Goodbye.